Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Danny, and this is my YouTube channel. If you're returning, so lovely to see you again. In today's video, I'm doing something a little bit different. I am going to Primavera Festival in Barcelona next month, which I am so excited for. Um, and I was like, do you know what? I need some festival clothes. So I went on ASOS, I did an order of like festival slash summer holiday clothes, and I thought I would unbox try on and give you my first impressions on camera so yeah i never really do fashion focused videos but i thought why the hell not let's see how it goes if this sounds like the kind of thing that would interest you please keep watching if you like this video give me a thumbs up and if you don't already subscribe to me go and hit that subscribe button it will really support the growth of my channel but without further ado let's get into the video So I've got my box of ASOS goodies here. Okay, so I got a whole load of different things. I'm not gonna do this in any kind of order. I'm just gonna grab something and then open it, tell you what it is, etc. I'm just gonna open my order. I got 10% off, like you can always get ASOS codes. It's my birthday tomorrow actually. Um, tomorrow when I'm filming this. By the time it goes up, it would have been my birthday already. It's on the 24th of May. Um, and yeah, I'll tell you how much everything is full price. You stop trying to bite my ASOS stuff. <laughs> cool, so first up. First up, I just went for a bum bag. Um, I just thought like cool festival butt vibes, like everyone needs a bum bag. I just thought this green color was really nice. I thought it would go with a lot of stuff and um, and it was like a bit more summery than just going with black. So it's got a zip here, and then a zip at the back as well, which is actually, I didn't realize I had a zip at the back. That's really good, because I could just like keep my money in there, and then it'd be really easy to get out. Um, and then obviously I can wear it like either round my waist, or if I feel like I'm being really cool, I can do the whole like, how do people do that? I think maybe I need to, people wear it like that I need to probably make it looser right yeah I'll definitely have to make it looser than that I mean I'm trying it on right now and I shouldn't be trying it on right now but yeah that's the bum bag I'm probably like very likely gonna keep this um this cost this was 10 pounds I thought that was really good value um and it's gonna come in very handy oh I know what this is so this is from the Millie collection and I just thought it was so fun I feel like this kind of like 60s swell pattern is very in at the moment and I just really loved this shirt so it's purple it's swir swirly and it's like a very very sheer very see-through it doesn't have buttons it just ties up at the front so I thought this would look really nice either like as a shirt that's you know quite revealing but you'd obviously like wear a bra or a bikini or something cute underneath or you could literally wear it like open as like a little jacket um but really love this um feels like really good quality actually it's got the the ties and yeah love it this cost me this is 25.50 so i thought that was quite good value and then obviously i got my 10 percent off as well I absolutely love this shirt. I've just put under it for now, like a little black um, bandeau. This probably isn't what I'd wear with it, but I uh, just threw it on to try on for the video. But yeah, I think it's really cute done up, but I love it even more, like undone as like a little jacket or something to throw over your shoulders when like it gets into the evening and it's a bit chillier and you just need something over your shoulders. But I think it's so pretty, it's so lightweight. Um, and yeah, it's ideal, it just fits really nicely. So yeah, we'll definitely be keeping this. Oh, another top here. Right, so this is a little crop top, which I absolutely adore. It's like kind of almost like an animal print, but not. Like it's purple and black. I, obviously, I'm really loving the purple. Uh, it's just got two straps there. And then it's got a little tie on the side here. And the whole point is that it's like pointed at the bottom. So like you wear it and it's got the point at the bottom. I've got another top similar to this, um, just plain black, which I wear quite often. And the point is nice, but I also sometimes like to fold it up so it is just like a pure, like straight crop top. So I'm thinking I'd probably do the same as that with that, but I wear that top all the time. And this kind of reminded me of it. Um, it's open at the side here, which just adds an extra little fun element, you know, get a bit of skin on display while you're at a festival. But yeah, really love that. I'm very excited to see what it looks like on. Um, 
I didn't say it at the start, but in terms of sizing, I think I bought 10 in most of this stuff. Um, let me just double check. Yeah, apart from the dresses, I've bought 10 in everything. Like I can kind of fit into like an eight or a 10, um, but I just find like tens just fit me a bit nicer. Like I just have a little bit more room. I'm a girl that like bloats quite often, quite often. I bloat quite a lot. So it's just nice to have that extra bit of space. Anyway, um, and this top was 14 pounds, which I think is a really good value. So yeah, really happy with that. Um, I really love this top. It's super, super comfortable. It's really, really soft. And again, like it's got some stretch to it. So it's quite forgiving. I just paired it with some like black trousers. Um, but you could wear this with so many different things. I wouldn't wear it like this on holiday because it's a bit like wintry. But yeah, it's really good. I think it's really flattering. It fits really nicely. And then this cutout detail just makes it a little bit more fun as well. Um, so yeah, this is what it looks like. And then the great thing about this tie here is that if you've got like bigger or smaller boobs, you can like tighten it or loosen it to make it suit like your body shape. So I love like clothes that kind of are adaptable. I will probably on the most part like end up, I like the point, but I do like rolling it up. So you've just got, so it just sort of sits like that. Um, but yeah, you can do either or. But yeah, really, really big fan of this and I will definitely be keeping it. Next up, oh right, this is a bikini. This is, so the other item coming today is the other half of this bikini. So I will probably try the bikini on a bit, like you'll see the clips are a bit different because um, I'll try the bikini on together. But this is the top, it's so cute. It's like this crinkly, crinkled material. It's like this gorgeous like, corally orange color and um it clasps at the back like this so that's like super pretty like the gold um and yeah it's not padded or anything so it's good for someone like me who doesn't have quite um so big so big boobs it's perfect for someone like me who doesn't have much boobage going on but yeah i just I love the crinkliness. I think it's really fun. I think it's really pretty. I think it will be very flattering and I'm very excited to see what that looks like. This bikini top is 15 pounds and the matching bottoms, which you'll see later are a tenner. So 25, sorry, the cat, if you can hear noises, it's the cat going mad. Um, so yeah, together those will be uh, 25 pounds, which I think is great for a nice bikini. Right, <laughs> excuse the change of angle and my lack of makeup, but I haven't filmed this yet, so I'm quickly doing it now and I'm standing on my toilet seat because I am yet to buy a full length mirror. But this is this bikini. I really love it. It's like super, super comfortable. Like the bottoms are real nice. Like I feel like they're a good shape and a good fit. Um, and yeah, it's just like super nice. Love the color. I think it's perfect for holiday. Like I said, really comfortable and I will definitely be keeping this. So next, oh, this is, this is a cropped cardigan. God, this look, okay, this is a lot more vibrant, like a lot brighter than it is in, a pic, in the picture. Let me just show you the picture. So this is the picture. It's like a baby pink in that, and this is like bright pink. I don't mind that, I think it's really pretty. Um, this cost £18.75, so it's just basically like a little cropped cardigan. It's quite revealing, so it just has like a little like clasp there, and then other than that, like, you're just out there, out there and proud. Um, so yeah, it's again, this like crinkly material, much like that bikini that I just showed you. It's this like quite bright pink color actually. Um, maybe corally, but more on the pink side. And yeah, like I said, it's nice and cropped with the gold detail here. Um, do you like it Donny? Thank you. <laughs> uh, I just thought this would look really cute like, either with a cute denim skirt or some denim shorts. Um, yeah, really, really pleased with that. I think it looks really pretty and again, we'll see what it looks like when it's on and then I'll decide if I'm gonna keep it or not. But yeah, it does feel quite revealing. Um, but again, I think where I've got, hey, I think where I've got um, smaller boobs, it will probably be okay on me. Okay, I actually really like this and it is quite revealing, but I think I can get away with it. Um, I'm undecided, so I think what I'm gonna do is like take it with me, and then if I don't end up wearing it, I can return it. But yeah, it's quite revealing, and I don't feel like 100% comfortable, but at the same time, like I do think it looks cute. 
um, like and could look cute with like some nice little denim shorts. But yeah, we'll see how we go. This is like a TBC. Um, but yeah, what do you think? Maybe let me know in the comments below if you think I should keep this one on or if you think it's a bit too revealing because I can't decide right now. But yeah, here it is. Then this is, I also got this bikini, which I, again, is that kind of 60s swell print um, look because that seems to be very in right now. So I'm just going to get both parts out. Right, so this is the bikini top. So it's this really nice purple and blue um, colour palette. And again, that 60s swell material. It's got a very kind of hard underwire. That is the way it goes, isn't it? Yeah, it's got a very hard underwire and then sort of just like sits like that. And then it's got these ties at the bottom, which you'd like tie around the back. And it's just meant to add like a little bit of extra detail, which is meant to look really pretty. So yeah, that's what the top's like. And this cost £15. And then the bottom is just like this. It's just, it's quite, quite narrow actually. Um, and then it's not like a total like cover of the bum situation like you've got just a little bit hanging out on the side it looks like but yeah really pretty bottoms um these were 18 pounds so it's actually oh no no the top was 18 the bottoms are 15. so i really enjoy this bikini i think it's really fun it fits really nicely and um, the bottoms are just like the perfect amount of like oh i've got a little bit on display but also like it's covering my modesty um and then the top is just like really fun i love the way this underwire sits and it like really works for my boob shape and then like this tie here just like adds a little bit of something extra um obviously this isn't ideal for tanning but this is more like festival vibes but i guess you could like reposition the way that you tie this so that it's not getting right in the way and you're not going to get like ridiculous tan marks there which i will probably end up doing to be honest because yeah who wants tan lines here but yeah really really love this bikini it fits me perfectly and i will definitely be keeping it um i also picked up a belly bar i feel like my belly bar falls out all the time um you'll see me wearing it like in the clips of me in the bikini but it's just like this gold and that belly bar um so it's like a nice gold i'm really into gold jewelry at the moment um that was six pounds so like really good value and while we're on jewelry i also got some anklets um it's like a pack of three and they just cost 10 pounds but you know anklet on holiday at a festival like i feel like it's a given but they're just like this mixture of like different gold ones so gold chains um and i just think they will be ideal and look lovely so next up so this is like a beach kind of mesh crochet beach dress um in a sort of cream color so i love this it's also got fringing at the bottom so yeah it's like got straps like this it's obviously crochet so you can see through it so the idea is that i'd wear it over a bikini it's got a tie up here at the front so you can like add a cute little bow and then yeah the fringing at the bottom um yeah, I just thought that would look really cool, like either when I'm chilling by the pool and I want to put something over, or I just thought this would look really cool at the festival itself, like maybe with a nice hat, um, and it would look quite nice with some boots, but I don't know if it's going to be too hot for that, but yeah, I'll give this a try and see what that's like. This was £35, so a little bit more on the spending side, but um, it does feel like it's slightly better quality, um, so hopefully it will be worth it when I put it on. I think this beach cover-up is really nice and I think it would be ideal. I actually think it would look quite nice with a belt round it, just to like add a little bit of shape, particularly if I'm going to be wearing it at the festival rather than it just being a beach cover-up. But yeah, I think it's really nice. Like, I think it covers up the right amount. Like, sometimes the cover-ups are so sheer that you can like literally see everything, whereas this is like a good amount. Um, but yeah, really like this, definitely going to keep it and... I'm gonna get a belt to see what it looks like, so bear with me. So yeah, I've just added a belt to it and I think it just really helps with the shape, like if I'm gonna be wearing it, yeah, at the festival, um, just makes it like look that little bit more slightly dressy. Yeah, I love it, I'm a massive fan. Definitely be keeping this. Ooh, this looks very different to the picture. Uh, so this was way more on the expensive side. This is 60 pounds, so I'm gonna have to really like it if I'm gonna keep it. 
but I thought this was great for the festival. So it looks so orange here, and in the picture, like you can barely see it. So hang on, this is it now. In the picture, you can like just barely see it. <laughs> but this is basically a Diamante mesh beach cover up in orange. So I just really wanted something like this for the festival because I just thought it would be really cool. But oh my god, it feels, I feel like I'm gonna break it. But yeah, it's essentially like a dress that has two straps like this. It's mesh and it's absolutely covered in diamantes as you can see, and I just thought this would look really cool, like at the festival, over a bikini. Um, it feels like very heavy actually, and I feel like I'm gonna break it. So I'll be very intrigued to see what it looks like on, but like I said, it's 60 pounds, slightly more on the expensive side. It's really long, like it's gonna come, it's like basically gonna be full length on me. But at the same time, I think it's gonna look really cool, so. Um, yeah, we shall see what that one's like. Okay, so this, I think it's really pretty and it's really fun, but like it feels so delicate on, like so delicate. Like I feel like I could just move in the wrong way and it will like break. And obviously like the whole idea is to be wearing this at a festival where I'm likely gonna be like getting very drunk, like screaming, dancing, losing my mind and I just can't, like if this was 20 quid, then yeah, I'd keep it. But for 60 quid, like risking breaking something like this, like I just can't keep this, like. And does it look that amazing? Like, yeah, it's all right, but I think we can do better. And I think for the price, it's just not worth it. Like the risk of like breaking it is very likely, particularly with me, I'm so clumsy. So yeah, this unfortunately is gonna be going back. So next up I have a skirt. I just love this kind of animal print, like the dotty. I've got quite a few things like that, but I saw that they were doing, this is basically like a midi length skirt. So, so it's polyester material. It's kind of like cream colored with the Dalmatian dot on it. Like I said, it's a midi length skirt. I don't believe it has a slit of any kind, um, but I just thought this would look really cute. I thought this would be a cute like, evening outfit when I'm on holiday because I'm basically going to the festival and then like having on ho a holiday afterwards to relax post festival um, so I just thought this was a really cute dress to wear with like a little crop top or something not dress skirt and it cost 30 pounds so again one of the slightly more expensive items so um we'll only be keeping it if I 100% love it yeah, I absolutely adore this skirt. I think like the length is really flattering. Um, you could really like dress this skirt up if you wanted to wear it for like a fancy evening occasion, but equally like, I'm, I'm just wearing it with a bandeau right now, uh, just cause it's what I had in my drawer that I could find quickly, but you could also wear it with like a white t-shirt and some trainers to dress it down. But yeah, I think it's really pretty, really fun. Um, fits really nicely and I'll definitely be keeping it. Again, like, it doesn't have a zip, it has like a stretchy waistband, which is ideal because it means if you bloat out a bit during the day, it will still fit you. Um, I love it when skirts like this don't have a zip. Um, but yeah, love it and we'll definitely be keeping it. This dress is really cute. Um, again, I think we're going down the like 60s vibes with it, which I'm just so feeling that it's in at the moment. But this is like a um, little sort of like checkerboard, uh, gingham style dress it's I never like really wear green but it's white and green um white and green gingham it comes up high so it's almost like a pinafore dress which I think is really cute but it comes up high at the front and then sort of um puffs out at the bottom I don't know the technical sayings I'm not a fashion person at all and then it's got these little cutouts at the side just to make it a little bit more like sexy and fun and then at the back um it's sort of like backless so it's got these stretchy um sleeves which is ideal because that means it will work on different chest sizes uh, and then it's just sort of open at the back so yeah I thought that was really cute yeah this dress was 25 pounds so I thought that was really good value for like um basically a whole outfit so here is this um, green mini dress. I'm actually not that keen on this. Like I think, one, it's a little bit tight for me. Um, I think it's really cute at the back, but 
the fit just isn't working for me. Like it's tight around my bum, it's quite loose on my stomach, and then like it's not fitting my boobs very nicely, and I just think these cutouts just don't do much for me. So yeah, not my favorite, and then it's a little bit tight around here as well. And then it's like loose here. It's really weird, like it's tight here, loose here, so it's just like really not fitting me in the best way in my body shape. It's a really cute dress, and like I love the pattern and I love the back, but um, yeah, we need to like, because I've ordered quite a lot, I need to be brutal and cut what I don't 100% love. So this one is going to be going back. And then we've got another cute summer dress here. And this one's all white. I cannot resist a white dress, even though I'm like the messiest person ever. But oh, I just love this. So this is just like a mini dress. It's white and it's almost got the like... Um, little cut out flowers on it and then it's got button detail like down the middle which i thought was really nice am i even showing it properly yeah so button detail down here the puff sleeves which will just look really feminine and really pretty and then yeah again it sort of like goes in at the top and then comes out like a little tea dress well that's what it's called it is a tea dress and yeah just that would be really cute again like summer evenings on holiday when like I've got a tan and yeah, just very lightweight, very pretty and very feminine. And again, this cost 25 pounds. So I thought pretty decent for a cute dress like that. This dress I love, I think it's really cute. I think it's really flattering. I'm obviously like wearing the total wrong underwear for it. Um, so I wouldn't be wearing black. Um, but yeah, I think this is really cute. I think it feels like the material is a little bit stretchy. So it's got a bit of give. So like if you're on holiday and you're like going out in the evening and you like, eat some delicious food and get a bit bloated like this is gonna like give you this is gonna be quite forgiving um but yeah i love it i think it's really sweet i think it fits really nicely um it's really comfortable and yeah i am a massive fan so i will be keeping this and then the last item another dress and again we're going down the 60s um like retro swell vibe and i love this dress in the picture so i'm hoping i love it in real life Oh, it's very different material to what I thought it was. I thought it was going to almost be like a satin material, but it's more like a cotton material. So this is just a really fun multicolored. So we've got greens, yellows, purples, pinks, orange, um, midi length dress. So it's got straps, it's strappy at the top and then a rounded neckline. It comes down and then it's got a slit like at the bottom. And then it's quite low, like not super low, but then it's pretty low on the back as well. Um, I just thought this would be like really, really fun for holiday and um, either like in the evenings or could be really good for the festival. It's just really bright. It's out there. It's fun. Um, and it looked amazing on the model in the picture. Like I said, like I get like kind of satin vibes from the picture, but this again was £25, which I thought for like a midi length dress that... I genuinely think you could dress this up and wear it for a wedding as well. Like, it's not just holiday vibes. Like, I think you could wear it for, like, a summer's wedding. Um, but I thought that was really good value, and I just had to get it. So, yeah, we'll see what it looks like. Um, this shape, this dress does not suit my body shape whatsoever. Um, hang on, let me put the camera down slightly. It's a really pretty dress, but at the same time, like... I think the colours look, looked a bit more muted on the ASOS app and it's really bright. So I, I love the pattern, but like it's super loose around my chest, as you can see. Um, I just think it does nothing for my figure. I have like quite a slim waist, so anything that accentuates my waist works better for me and this just doesn't. It just looks a bit like a sack on me. Um, it's a really pretty dress, but yeah, it doesn't suit me. It doesn't fit me properly. So I will be sending this one back. So yeah, that's everything. I hope this has sort of given you um, inspiration on some items if you're looking to do a bit of a holiday festival shop. Um, I've linked everything that I showed you and that I've tried on in the comments below. Um, but yeah, if you like this kind of like style of fashion video, like let me know. I'm definitely gonna like stick to doing food as my main thing because I'm more comfortable with it and it's more of my thing. But um, yeah, if you're interested in seeing like my ASOS hauls, cause I seem to do quite a lot of them, <laughs> without filming them then let me know in the comments below if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you don't subscribe to me go and hit that subscribe button because it will really support the growth of my channel but yeah i will see you next time bye